Welcome everybody to another episode of 80s and 90s Rewind the Times. The show is all 80s and 90s stuff. Uh, today I got in another piece of my Motu Origin set. <coughs> I got in Buzzsaw Hordak. Uh, really excited about this toy. It came out a couple days ago in California and a buddy of mine reached out to me on eBay. <coughs> and he said, Mike, I got two of them. And I bought both of them instantly, and they gave me a really good price on them and shipped them to me, and they came in today. And I just opened them up, and I'm going to review them with you guys. I'm super excited to show you, and uh, here we go. So first I'm going to show you the card art. The, I'm first I'm going to show you the, the card art on the card, and I'm going to show you the comic. Uh, Axel Menes did an amazing job with, uh, with the card art on this. It looks super awesome, super sharp. Colors look awesome, and the comic book is really cool too, so hold on. First is the cover, guys. Really, really cool. And here's the back. Hordak fly, flying, fighting flying fist He-Man. So that, I think, is going to be a hint of him coming. There's the castle. And there's the Wind Raider. That's going to be really cool. So super excited about that, guys. The comic has... Mosquito or on it. So this is gonna be a really 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 cool. I believe he's in a deluxe set that's coming up, so I'm gonna show you the comic book real quick. The comic looks really really cool on this. I like the comic book for this one guys, this one's pretty cool. This whole, this whole, this whole, this whole set's awesome. I love the Evil Horde. Evil Horde is my favorite faction. So, okay, and here he is himself, Buzzsaw Hordak. Now, this Buzzsaw Hordak comes with two faces, and since I already have, I, since I already have the other one with, with uh, this is the one that come, that came on with. So I decided to do this one. I took this, took that head off. I put this one on. Kind of got, kind of got of a grin. A little, I think a little bit more menace, menacing, evil look to it. Um, now, for anybody that's ever had the um, the Buzzsaw one, uh, the action the, the action on it's a little different. It took me a little while. I, I don't actually own the, the Buzzsaw one. I don't own the vintage. So, I thought you just, I thought simply you just put it in here. You open his chest up. I thought you just put it in there, and then you just there's a lever on the back right here, guys. And I thought you just push it and it comes out. No, it doesn't work that way. If it was only that simple. <laughs> Basically, you open them up, and there's two, two, two buzz saws. There's this type, and then there is this one. You take it and you put it in here. And it's gonna snapping you hear it popping and then you can shut his chest and now just because it's locked in there doesn't mean that you push it will not work if you do that this is what's gonna happen nothing chest will open just a little bit it just gets jammed so basically what you do is you put it back in there it's locked shut it and now let's say you know Hordak's having his battle he's fighting Moss Man or Fisto or He Man. You open it up and ready for some 3D. And all of a sudden you push it. Boom! And then it comes out flying at you. So that's how the action works. Once again, I'm going to use the other one. You take it in, lock it in there. You shut it. You know, you're doing your battle. Ah, right, He Man, I got something that'll whoop your ass. And you open it up, he looks at you, smiling, saying, yeah, I got you. And then, boom, that was actually perfect, that hit the screen, that was actually kind of cool looking, that was like a 3D effect, I like that one, I'm a big nerd, that was so cool. <laughs> it also, come with, also comes with two hands, it comes with this one, and it comes with a small, like a, like a gripping one, I decided to take this one off 
and I put this one in. So, and then it comes with his, the famous, you know, Hordak, you know, crossbow. So, this bus saw all that, guys. So, super excited he came in today. Hope you guys can get him. I know right now he's on the West Coast, so um, that's where I got it from. Thank you, James, uh, the guy who hit me up uh, for two of them. I actually got two of them for 50 bucks. So, in $10 shipping, so $60. I think that's a pretty good deal considering some of these are going for like 80, 90. It's ridiculous. So hopefully you get them on the East Coast. I mean, I mean it sucks being on the East Coast because I live in Rhode Island, so I'm on the East Coast. We get these things so late, and then people are just jacking the prices on eBay. But you know, I can't complain. You know, I mean, I'm I'm not one of those people that don't do that. I want to help collectors. I'm not knocking anybody down. I'm not like that. I'm not a I'm not a judgmental person. But I try to help other collectors you know because I know times are tough and everything but that's just me that's just me not saying I'm better than anybody but that's just how I do things so so there he is man Buzz so Hordak so I just want to say thank you everybody for watching this video if you're new like and just subscribe and uh, leave some comments and I'll go back and forth with you talking hey guys everybody have an awesome moto day and uh, take care and God bless guys take care